everyone. Me and Teddy are actually just on a little walk before I go to the gym with Lucy soon. He's not really good at walking. He likes to just eat all the leaves. <laughs> Come on. Come on. I'm gonna get a little doggy. Come on. My voice is kind of still gone, if you guys can tell. <laughs> Doggy. <laughs> He's hot after our walk. So guys, basically what's going on is yesterday we didn't vlog because we are like legit like five days behind just because I was traveling for so long when I went to visit Mandy in Long Island and then we were in New York City on Sunday and then Sunday night and then Monday and then Tuesday morning we were in Lake George. So yeah, basically we just haven't had that much time to like edit and upload and stuff so we're so behind on vlogs. Like right now one is uploading from last... Thursday and then I'm gonna try to get the one from last Friday up today as well So we're gonna have to start doing like two every day to like just like catch up But I was like, okay, we can't not vlog today Like we didn't already vlog yesterday and I was sad because I like vlogging and as you can tell my voice is gone So that is what's going on and Lucy is on her way home now because She's gonna pick me up because we're going to the gym And yeah, oh and I think we're going out to dinner with Julia tonight. I was like having her in the vlog She's super fun. We'll look at Teddy right now <laughs> You're crazy. We got him so big, we took him to the vet yesterday. He was 36 pounds. What are you doing? This is Lizzie's song. Oh my gosh, that was such a good workout. Thanks for showing me it, Lou. Obviously, I've always like biked before, like I know how to bike and whatever, and I used to really hate it, and that just made me love it, which is so weird. Like I just always hated biking, because it would just be boring and tedious, and I would never like change my like resistance, or it would never be like in intervals, you know, and it was always just like long and steady and boring. But then, Lucy just showed me, um, I didn't know that like, Spin, spin bike, the spin bikes that you always talked about were like that. Like when I've gone on like spin bikes before, they're just oh, very no. basic oh, and wow. don't have like cool settings. And Lucy just did one with me, and it's like intervals, and it like literally shows you what to do. Like you sit down and you hold on a certain way, and you pedal a certain like cadence. resistance cadence. Yeah, like, and it's so fun because you're like constantly changing every three or four or five minutes. So it's yeah. so fun. Oh my gosh. When you have two so gym so memberships because you're really trying to get in shape. I wore my Planet Fitness shirt to um the why and basically if you guys didn't know well you probably do i feel like we've talked about it so much but basically we've always worked part-time as lifeguards at the ymca lucy still does that and i was going to start this summer obviously when i got back from bu and i was filling out the paperwork because i had to like be put back into the system i was like you know what like i just don't feel like doing it i was like i just don't want to work part-time there like i have so many other commitments with our other lifeguarding job but you guys know we're not lifeguarding there anymore because we felt really overwhelmed and um but yeah at the time i had that lifeguarding job i had youtube but like want to have fun in the summer like spend time with family go on vacation get in shape so i was like i'm not gonna do that so now i have time to like actually work out do YouTube like it's so great now that I'm not lifeguarding anywhere so a part of me wishes that I was still working part-time there but I wouldn't have known that I wouldn't have worked full-time at the other place you know so I mean whatever at this point but yeah now I have like two gym memberships which is really funny but Planet Fitness my friend Hannah goes to so I'll probably still go there like once in a while with her just because it's fun to like work out with friends Lucy hates it I went there once and like it gives me a headache and none of the yeah. machines I like use so I was like the ones that she likes aren't there and like I, and it doesn't I have only pool. use like two machines and like they're both not there so I was like and it like honestly the purple and yellow colors kind of stress me out a little bit but yeah anyway I'm just like really happy that Lucy showed me that and I'm like really into spinning and I've always wanted to go to like a spinning class like Soul Cycle or like something like that maybe when we go to Boston Lucy like if we have time sometime we'll like stop by Soul Cycle I just feel like it would be so fun after just doing that one time like I literally I feel like I, I can't really I don't have much grounds to say a lot about it because I have done it once but it was just so fun and you burned so many calories and I was sweating like crazy but it didn't even feel like too hard you know so basically I'm just this is my new obsession spinning I feel like it's so trendy I'm going spinning I've like been doing it like all summer but I would do like I would, I would never do like the, the video things or whatever um and I would just do like alternate sitting and standing mm -hmm. That was okay. so fun. Um, so that's what I would do, but then one day I was like, yeah, I'm kind of bored of that. Like, I bet. And then I was like, I'm just gonna like play around with this thing. So I was uh -huh. like, playing and stuff. And I said like videos and like, I think 
do like intervals. And there's a little guy that tells you intervals, what to do. Intervals, strength, endurance, like all these different options. He's big. <laughs> and at the end, he like stretches, and that's what I was trying to show you. He like goes like that, and, like stretches oh. his arms, and like his back, like opens up his shoulders. There's so stuff. much, cause a lot of it is like either you're standing or you're sitting, or this one thing but called jump where you stand and sit, time. stand and sit. Lucy's it's was a like lot of standing. Left, Mine towards like, the end was so much standing. I'm like, can I please sit? Like, why does it keep giving me standing? Like, there's standing, climbing, standing, running, standing, pedaling, standing. No, standing, climb, standing flat. Oh, standing, standing flat. Running with resistance and jumps. And, and jumps. And there's like and there's sitting, flat, sitting flat, sitting, sitting climbing. climbing. Like, so yeah, there, all that. But yeah, this has been a long clip of just basically cycling is session and I'm actually proud that I have like two gym memberships because like I have no excuse for not like working out every day and something I wanted to mention is you guys have asked literally for so long like forever about like our workout routine and I have some fitness videos on my main channel Christian Loves Beauty if you don't know if this is like your first video of mine if you've been living under a rock and I'm just kidding but um yeah I have some fitness videos on there but not any like recent like updated ones and obviously for the summer our workout routine is going to change then how it is like during the school year, you know? So Lucy is already pretty much in like a solid like groove, like workout routine and I think um, joining another gym is gonna help me get into an even more like solid routine because usually my workouts are so sporadic and I don't have a plan and it's like annoying and frustrating. Yeah, and I, like, tr I've been traveling a bunch so this is gonna help me like get into a real like groove of like working out and we will try to do a workout routine video at some point in the coming weeks. So yeah, and hopefully, I think we're gonna go to the drive-ins tonight so we can cross that off the bucket list. Maybe we'll try to find something else to do because we are running out of time, Lucille. It is yeah, coming close to the end of the summer. I wanna do tie-dye. Do you know where we can do a Pilates class? Yeah, Pilates principle. Where? I was looking at it. Pilates principle, it's like, oh, there's like classes Thursdays, I think. Huh. So I wanted to try that, like performer Pilates. Okay, this clip is really long, but yeah, basically, happy day. And also for those of you that don't work out, like, I don't know if this is gonna help motivate you like at all, but here's some motivation for the day. For me, I'm quite a lazy person, I feel like naturally. So I will think of any excuse like in the book to not work out. But like, just let me tell you from experience, like the hardest part is getting started. Like if you actually put on your shoes and like walk out the door and just start working out, it's so, well first of all, it's so much easier to just keep going. Like once you start, like, at least for me, like if I start, I'm like, okay, I'm not gonna stop like two minutes in. Like you just keep going, so that's way easier. And you just feel so much better after. You just, have, like you have like endorphins after, you just feel so much better. So basically, if you need help getting started and some motivation, like let me tell you the whole idea of working out becomes like 100 times easier once you put on your shoes and walk out the door like just get started and it's gonna be a whole lot easier pro tip all right so that's our secret to working out literally just get started and keep going okay, and I'm like, and been like it was easier like to keep yourself going like if you're like oh my god i can't do an hour of this if, there, if there's like videos or something and if you're like changing it like if you like nervous. Lucy's the type of person though, like I feel like with running and stuff, like you don't get that bored that easily. So you could yeah. do like steady state running for two hours and not get bored. Yeah. For me, like I do. So if you do like intervals and if you're changing like speeds and like if you run, walk, run, walk like that, or if you're doing cycling, like standing, sitting, standing, sitting, it's like way easier. So there's another tip. And also, last tip about working out since we've been filming for over eight minutes now, follow Lucy on Spotify and me too. I just started a cycling or spinning playlist. And Lucy's playlist for working out are seriously fire. Like I always listen to her sweat one and I listen to her what other one do I listen I to? to Jammin', Steady I State Erging. Like I listen to so many and they're all really good. So literally follow her on Spotify, Lucy Garrity, and mine is Gretchen Garrity. Because we have really good workout playlists. So that is pretty much a secret to working out. And have fun getting a really hot summer bod. Yeah. <laughs> every bod is a summer bod. Uh, <laughs> she goes, every bod like, is a summer bod in the summer. Like thing, like, like a bikini, bikini body. body. Like put, step one, put a bikini on. Yeah. Step two, go outside. There's your like, bikini body. I got three cavities filled today. My mouth is still so numb. <laughs> when Lucy picked me up, she was like... Was like <laughs> She's like, couldn't smile. Picture, right? <laughs> um, but it was like the top left and the bottom right so my face is just like all numb and like my whole tongue I like couldn't feel it. Lucy this is giving me such a long vlog today. Okay.
Peace. Yum! The fresh kale salad from Cheesecake oh, is it. my favorite. Ooh, snap. Yeah, that was hideous. <laughs> <laughs> Julia got ahi tartar because she wasn't that hungry, but we already ate a bunch of guac and bread. And what did you get? Um, Asian chicken salad. <laughs> Without chicken. <laughs> And I also got rigatoni and red sauce on the side because you guys know that's my favorite. Yum. Also, I want to let you guys know that we are going to um, the drive ins after this. But look, at, it's dying. Like the battery is really low and I can't find the charger. So, yeah, we're going to try to get as much footage as we can. Oh, yeah, we can use our phones. We're going to see Ice Age and we're going to see Secret Life of Pets, which is going to be good. Because we're children. Yep. Julia, what do you think? I think it's delicious. It's so good, it's right? 10 out of 10 recommend dairy-free ice cream. It's literally amazing. Yeah. I just put on my Snapchat story also, and I was like... Also, try the Snickerdoodle one because that is Ooh, my jam. Yes. We had that together for the first time, right, Julia? Mm -hmm. Near my house. <laughs> one is the <laughs> new salted caramel cluster. I saw it on like, Instagram and, I can't and then like, speak Gretchen English. and I were at Whole Foods that day and I was like, we're getting it. Oh, so good. good. Say hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> we're watching Ice Age. It's so good. Uh, I actually love this movie. Yeah, wow. I do too. <laughs> the drive-ins are so fun. Now you are here. Now we're watching way. Secret Life of Pets. We're closing in. This you is where I can eat. It's 12.07 and I'm really Where's tired. Way? I fell asleep. Are you so tired, yeah. Julia? <laughs> <laughs> but this movie's really Ooh. good too. It is good. Cute. I, I really think like I'm going to take the kids to <laughs> see it on Friday. Oh. My children I love it. Not that I birthed. <laughs> <laughs> by myself <laughs> so yeah we just got back from the drive-ins and I am so tired we are just about to go to bed and my voice still sounds gone and when I'm tired it gets worse so yeah basically those are really good movies and if you haven't seen Ice Age or Secret Life of Pets definitely would recommend Julia and Lucy are talking if you can hear them but yeah thank you so much for watching today's vlog I'm happy we did something on the bucket list and we'll see you tomorrow bye